bekämpfen. Wir sind in der Two. Right. Battle. Right. Yeah, Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lily here and if you can see my face. Really, 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 really bad. So today I'm gonna show you how to cover the acne. I can say that I tried really everything. I tried peelings, I tried anti-acne products, I tried actually everything what exists to, to get rid of, of the acne but nothing helped so I went to my dermatolo derma dermatologist is it right? dermatologist? <laughs> dermatologist Lily and he recommended me Roaccutan so Roaccutan is really um, Roaccutan is actually a really strong treatment that I'm I'm trying now and I will do a review and, and I will show you the results so let's get started so let's begin and yes that's my face when I wake up every day looking at the mirror with this horrible acne scar yeah so let's begin with the dis with disinfect my hands uh, I, it can be a normal disinfection lotion that I that you can find at the drugstore or supermarket so it's very important using a disinfection lotion after you're playing something with your hands. Then for moisturizer I'm using as usual the Sibamid Mattifying Face Lotion that I love. It's actually perfume free. And lately I like using this cute panda under eye stick. Yes, it's very cute. And uh, this panda hydrates the under eye area and gives a lot of freshness. So let's move on to the foundation. To cover up the acne scars, I'm using my favorite camouflage foundation by Estee Lauder. I like use it only on the redness, so on the top of the acne scars and not on the entire face. So here I am tapping it with the finger on top of that and then I'm applying my liquid foundation. This one's by Maybelline New York, the better skin that I blend after with the beauty blender. Yes, my silly faces, like always. Before I used to be a beauty blender, I like to dump it in the in water so it gets smoother and easier to blend the foundation. Good job, Lily. You're showing everything. Now it's time to bake the cake. Bake the cake? Uh, no, bake the face. <laughs> For this, I'm using my favorite one and the cheaper and a cheaper alternative. Baby powder by Johnson's and I'm applying it with the beauty blender again. Uh, let's continue with contouring my face. I'm using the Hula Bronze by Benefit, what else? And I'm applying it with an angled brush. Like as you can see, I'm tapping the bronzer with the, with the brush and not rubbing it because when I rub it, the foundation meant to get off so so in a weird way and when it, I tap it with the brush, it kind of stands longer and keeps the foundation in its place. On its place. Its place. Now for blush, I'm using the Peaches by MAC, one of my favorite ones. And let this cheekbone stay out on using the Mineralize by MAC. Now finally I take off the baby powder because I can't get out with those white powder on my face. And for this I'm using a normal face brush. And that's the result. So as you can see acne is very hard to cover up. At least those big pimples are always staying out. So I hope you liked the video, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for free 
to my channel to stay updated for more to come and follow me on the social media. See you next time. Bye.